Hi, hello. This is the fourth video blog. Thank you for following. Today I would like to introduce you a small piece of Japanese history. This is Kamakura. And Kamakura was the capital of Japan during the Kamakura period, from 1192 until 1333. During this time, there were built seven entrants. This entrance, in order to access to Kamakura, were called Kiridoshi. Most of these Kiridoshis were rebuilt into roads for cars. Except two. Two of them remained as original. Like this one, Daibu Tsukiridoshi. Do you want to have a look? Follow me. And these are the Kiridoshis. Run! Corre, corre! Follow us! Nowadays, the Kamakura residents use these Kiridoshis for running or trekking. By the way, if you ever come to Kamakura and you want to do some exercise, join us! This place was chosen because it's easy to defend. At the south is the sea. North, west, east is surrounded by mountains. The natural fortification made Kamakura an easily defensible stronghold. Then, in order to access the capital, it was necessary to build the seven Kiridoshis. Let's have a closer look.
Satoshis, served Kamakura for 141 years to connect with nearby cities and protect from their enemies. The Kamakura period begins in 1192, after the conflict between the clans of Taira and Minamoto. The founder of the Kamakura shogunate was Minamoto no Yoritomo. He was the first shogun. The period is known for the emergence of the samurai, the warrior caste, and for the establishment of feudalism in Japan. That's all for the fourth video. There are many more things to explain. Please keep tuned. If you are a Japanese history expert or you want to collaborate somehow, contact me. Let's make together a great content. Please like and subscribe. See you next week.